Hi, it's Heather, and today is a very good day for an adventure in gardening. Today, go ahead, it's your turn, you say. And we're going to go to the park too. We're going to go to the park too. Today is going to be our first official field trip, and we are going to Lavender Pond Farm on Roastmeat Hill Road in Killingworth, Connecticut. And you know the thing about like roads in Connecticut, sometimes you just wonder like who who named that? Were they hungry when they named it? I don't know. But um, I have been looking forward to going to Lavender Pond Farm for a really long time. And my sister is driving. And the kids are in the back. Everybody say hi. Hi. Hi, yeah. We're just so excited. So can't wait to show you the pictures. Can't wait to get there. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Pretty close. Are we there yet? Almost. How about now? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Lou, are we there yet? Um, I don't see lavender plants. You don't see lavender plants? No. How about now? No. Are you looking out the window even? Do you see anything? Oh, lavender Oh, farm's yeah. down. <gasps> Coffee bar. Coffee bar. Oh. Oh, look at those plants. Ooh. Oh, I just saw the baby. Oh. smell all the lavender flowers? Yeah. All of them? Yeah. Oh, we're going to be here a while. Are we going to smell the bees? Ooh, bees? In your nose? Yeah, that doesn't sound fun. That doesn't sound fun at all. Oh, Andy, you're the bee sniffer. Yeah. He's the bee whisperer. <laughs> He's a bee whipster. Whipster. He's a, he's a bee whipper. Whipster. Whipper. Whipper. Helpers. I'm sure we're going to see a lot of them. No, not bees. Oh, peppers, pepper. Frog, okay. friend. Okay, got it. Um, but it's not really nice. It's a mean one. Well, there's a lot of people here. Yeah, I know. I said that. I know. I know. You did say that already. Everyone got a little jingle jangle in their pocket? A little extra spending money? No. No. Are we parking in this place? I think that's a great place to park. Okay. Oh no. Really? I'm so sorry, honey. Lavender smells the same. No, it doesn't. Blasphemy. Lavender does not look the same. Andy's making one. Andy, did you put that up your nose? I smell the bees. Oh my goodness. Look at how beautiful. Oh, happy, happy, happy bees. So many bees. Mm-hmm. Look at how happy they are. Oh my goodness. Little bumbly bees. Oh my goodness, it smells so nice, even from here. What do you think, Lou? You're gonna smell it? I'm smelling the whole group. Mm-hmm. different kinds of lavender? There are. There might, maybe we should look for signs to see if they have them labeled, okay? Wow, look at that plant. There's even another plant over there. There are another, yep, look, other plants over there. Oh my goodness. No, there's a yellow plant. Why do they have those there? Look yeah, I think that. that one. That one's this one. You think so? Yeah, that was the one. Hmm. And yeah, that's... yep. Oh yeah, okay. It doesn't have any bees on it. Hmm? It doesn't have any bees on it. No, it doesn't have any bees on it. I wonder. Mommy, yeah? that one doesn't have any bees on it. Now what's up with those ones over there that are like white looking? White? I wonder if they haven't bloomed yet or? 
All right. Oh, oh my goodness. So many bumblebees. Hey, Susie. It's like a bumblebee party, Lou. Bumblebee party. Yeah. Yeah. Bumblebee bee party. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go yep. see what that sign over there says in the corner here. The yep, so this lavender here is phenomenal. How'd you like a name like that? I'm phenomenal. Yes, honey. Oh, yeah, that, yep, yep. Sometimes it happens with lavender, though. But these are phenomenal. What does it say? Hide coat. Yep, so that's what kind this one is. Oh like my it. goodness, it's short and compact. I got a dragon, a dragonfly right here. How cute. Oh, out of the middle, okay. These ones are really pretty. So I see a lot more honeybees in these over here. <laughs> Maybe the honeybees like these better. So that is pretty cool, a uh, life-size chest. And Billy's totally making the rules. He's making the rules. Yeah. He's really good at that. <laughs> Which is why these things drop in the night. <laughs> <laughs> so this one is called Big Time Blue. And it's really cute. It's got great color. Let me see. Yes, that one's called Big Time Blue. And this white one is Edelweiss, which is interesting. Well, that's a good question. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Does he know how to play chess? Billy? Yeah. Oh. Oh, wow. Hmm. Apparently he was doing that wrong now. <laughs> yeah, so this one is Grasso, and I like this one because it would be great for drying because it's got the long stems. And it just looks really, and it's very super full. I like that one. But then this one I like too. That one's also pretty long stems, like not. As oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I gotta stay on the path. Stay on the path. Yeah, I like this one too. I have to see what it's called though. So, I think that this one over here is called Let me see. Oh my goodness. You know what this is, honey? This is Russian sage. Mm -hmm. well, that's a Japanese beetle on the Russian sage. Squeak it. Oh, okay. All right. I got him. Oh, I missed him. Oh, he flew away. Good. Well, I mean, kind of good, but he's going to go someplace else. Yeah, Russian sage is a really pretty plant, isn't it? Mm hmm. Well, I think this is phenomenal. I think that's what this one is. I think that's a uh, bee bomb, honey, like we have at home. <laughs> Daisy. Mm -hmm. So look at this butterfly weed. Holy mackerel, look at the color. And it's huge. So pretty. There's the beehives, honey beehives over there. I guess they have their own um, lavender honey that they sell here, but I, I think I read online that they were out of it right now. But definitely worth the trip to come and get some lavender honey. <laughs> Oh, 
boy, this place is gorgeous. Oh my gosh, so much lavender. Just gorgeous. Boy, you can spot them, can't you? I just think I get that squash. Yeah, you gotta squish them. I really like this variety. Gorgeous. So many bees. Okay, I think this one actually might be my favorite right here. So this is Grasso. Again, we're looking at Grasso, but I really like it because it's got the long stems on it and it's very, the plant itself is like very short and compact and I can smell it from here. Like I'm standing here and I can smell lavender. So I really like this one. I'm coming. I'm just getting the money shot right here because man, that is so gorgeous. Beautiful. <laughs> okay, I think I like them all because I like the little short compact bright colored ones and then I like the unruly one there. I, I think that one's really cool looking. I like the color. And it's a little wild looking. Oh, there's the train. So I read online right now they're only doing um, family, they're, like they're <laughs> Lucy Jean. <laughs> they're only doing family rides right now, so you have to pay a flat fee for the whole family. Okay, so this bed that had that wild looking one and all the different colors, it says in that bed is Munstead, Levance, Giant Hidcoat, and Phenomenal. So I'm going to have to look up Giant Hidcoat and Levance when I get home to see which ones exactly those were. Oh, that is so cool. This is totally on my list to do in life. But I really need a big, strong nephew to help me lift the hives. That's the only thing that's been stopping me. If only I knew somebody nearly six feet tall that would help me. If only. That loves his auntie. That loves his auntie. You should probably hire somebody. Oh, I'll have to hire somebody else's nephew. Oh, Billy? You think Billy would do it? That is so cool though. Look at all those bees. Honeybees alive and well at Lavender Pond Farm. Lucy Jean, what was your favorite part that you saw today at the Lavender Farm? Um, it was the orange plant. Oh, the, the butterfly weed? The no, Asclepius? The, no, the one that was like Japanese beetles. Yes. The orange Japanese beetles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're so silly. No, it looks like it. Mm-hmm. I'm going to show you. Okay. Hang on. I'll show you in a minute. Andy, what was your favorite favorite part today? I liked everything. You liked everything? Yeah. Okay. Okay. How about you, Bubba? I like the beehives. The beehives. The beehives were very cool. I like to watch you guys play chess. That was very cool. Was that your favorite part? Um, Mommy, what was your favorite part? Yeah, mommy. What was my your favorite, favorite part? part? Was spending time at family. Family time. Family time without daddy. Family time without daddy. Okay, so this is the labyrinth, the lavender labyrinth. So stay on the path. Follow.
follow the yellow brick road or the white brick road. Follow the white brick road. Follow the white brick road. Follow, 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 follow. Follow the white brick. <laughs> so cute. Okay, now I'm totally going. Oh no, I'm lost. Lucy, I'm lost. Where am I? She's like, do I go back and help her? Oh, oh she is. She's totally going back to help me. <laughs> All right. All right. Okay, show me the way. Show me the way. <laughs> oh no, no. No, we're supposed to stay on the path. Stay on the path. All right. I'm following you, Lou. Following you. Oh, got to walk by Edelweiss. Edelweiss, Edelweiss. Oh, I'm coming. I'm getting distracted. Oh, look at this one. So cute. I like that. Hi, Bubba. Oh man, this is such a great setup. I love this. Ooh, that feels like home. If only you had a six foot tall nephew. If only I had a nephew who has already vowed to take care of his auntie. Mind you, it was before he was a teenager. There's no takey backies. No takey backies. Um, I think, Let's, I think it's that. Do I think. Think. No, I want you to make this for me. I love this. I, I love. I love all of it. It's a bill. Honey, we're look look through. Look through. Let's look let's find the chickens. Where are they? Do you see a lavender color chickens? Because I see two and I don't have a lavender color chicken. Bill, yes. I need a lavender color chicken. Two of them. That's what that that's what they call that gray one, I do believe. Why? Because it eats lavender. It's like a flamingo. You know how the flamingo eats all the shrimp and it turns pink? They eat lavender and turn that color. Not really, just kidding. Not really. They're so pretty though. Oh, I need those. I need them really bad. What a great setup. I love this. In the shade. This chicken's got it made in the shade. So thanks for joining us on our family fun day and the first field trip for Adventures in Gardening. And we had a great time at Lavender Pond Farm. We looked at all the lavender plants and we smelled them all. And it's just a beautiful place to visit and we will definitely be back again. So thanks for joining me and remember, every day is an adventure. See you soon. <laughs>